I could tell that before we went to the eye doctor that something was wrong. And I mean, I would have trouble seeing, I would squint all the time. It's where I'm, I'm losing my center vision. I'll only be able to see side to side. Okay, Stargardt's is a, I mean, it is a very rare disease, like one out of, I think, 10,000 or something like that births are gonna have it. And it's kind of like uh, elderly people commonly get macular degeneration. Uh, and this is kind of like a macular degeneration of, of, uh, of young people. They generally get it in the first uh, one to two decades of life. Honestly, we were more devastated than he was. <laughs> um, it was a big shock for us because, I mean, he, he's a teenager and we know that there's going to be difficulty, difficulties for him, that, uh, just not just driving. But uh, we knew that, that life was going to continue to be, you know, a curveball all the way around. So it was, it, was, it was harder on us than it was on him. Tristan's my only boy. And, I mean, he's always been a mama's boy anyway. So I guess I just, even at 17, I still try to do everything for him. Well, and just everyday stuff. I mean, fixing... Everybody fixes their own plate at dinner time, but you know you can have hot dogs and he can't see to put the ketchup where it goes, you know, or you know when he's fixing his plate he might miss the plate. So being a trainer, it, I mean it helps me learn about medical stuff, but it also gives me something to look forward to every year. I love how everybody comes to me and knows that I know what to do. Hopefully he won't listen to people that try to limit him. That's, that's going to be the biggest deal. And we've talked about that. You know, don't let other people tell you what you can't do. I spend a lot of time during the day just looking at people just to see who it is. And they have specialists coming to teach me how to use the walking stick. Uh, uh, the problem with uh, at school and at home, doing my homework, is the lighting. Uh, before I got this, I had a lamp that I would just shine on my paper or I'd get my phone on my light, I mean the light on my phone and make it so I can see. But now with this, it gives me direct light and I can just look at the screen. a home-cooked meal restaurant. So I'm gonna open it around College Station for the college young adults that miss home but can't go on weekends to go get a home-cooked meal. Basically, I, re I can rely on God to help me and to know that he has everything and that he does everything for a reason.